Hey girlies, it's me, Joni82, and I'm here to do, I, I guess it's not really a face of the day, more of the lip of today. Um, for my lip combination inspiration, kind of went to the new Jordan Oreos that I posted on my Instagram. If you can see, it's like gray, then it has speckled black. That's why they call it the Oreo. And this is, I got these last Saturday, so these are the newest Jordans that I have. I think these are the fours. Okay, I think they are. Um, so I, how I usually base my wardrobe is basically I I go backwards. I kind of go from the shoes. Um, the pants are pretty basic. I'm mean, either in leggings or like stretch jeans, jeggings or whatever you want to call them. Then the top, then the makeup. That's pretty much how I do it. Or if it's like a certain color eyeshadow that I'm like dying to wear. Or, a, you know, a colored liner. I start with that and then build my wardrobe on that. So, my wardrobe is pretty much based on my eyes eyes or lip color and my shoes. Which is pretty... I don't know if that's weird. Because I know most people do their outfit and then coordinate the shoes. And I guess the makeup could be considered um, accessory. I don't know. But that's just how I base how I'm going to dress for the day. So... You guys know that I recently did a, a whole slash swatch video of the Ruby Kisses matte lacquers. And I did mention, I think I mentioned that I was going to pair this with a color icon pencil. So I did. And I also um, added one of the matte Ruby Kisses lipstick. And this is what I came up with. So I'm just going to go through the products and give swatches and names. So what I did first was the color icon pencil in charcoal. This is actually an icon. Um, this is number 655 and you guys know that wet and wild is revamping their Collection and I know like I think they're discontinuing a lot of the pencils and coming up with the new formulated pencils and the new colors From the new selection. I don't recall seeing a gray color. So I mean I could be wrong with that but um, if not, I don't know if they're going to discontinue this so it's a good, you know, time to go out and try to find this if you want to, um, you know, kind of use this lip combination or, you know, possibly do, you know, make up your own whatever with this pencil. So I don't know if this is going to be around long. So for 99 cents or less, 89 cents, you can go pick this up and, you know, it's just well worth it. Um, I've even used this um, for my eyebrows when I don't want brown brows, but I don't do black brows. This kind of gives me like... A unique look like it's very subtle on the eyebrow so I do that every once in a while when I just want to switch it up so this is charcoal I'm trying to give you a nice dark swatch so I basically lined and filled my lips with that then I use gray light the matte lipstick and actually when I lined and filled my lips with this color honestly it was pretty close to spice cake by Melt, and I'm gonna swatch that right next to it. Oh, uh, actually, it's a little bit different, but it kind of gave me that look on my lips when I just did the the gray liner back. So, so this is gray light. It looks a little wonky because I did, you know, had the um the liner on top of it. So that's what that is, and I just felt that like I needed to deepen that a little bit, and that's what the charcoal um liner did and then on top of that to give it a little moisture because we know these are super matte so they're super drying on the lips and i just put what is this insecure on top which is very close to that but it gives you like slight moisture like movement with the color like it's not shiny or gloss we know that because it's matte but it kind of makes it more comfortable on the lips so this is the three items that i use and i came up with this and like i said the inspiration came from my shoes because it has like this gray color right there so yeah let me know what y'all think it's just i'm just gonna run some errands today so all i did was my brows um I use my Wet n Wild liner today because it's starting to dry out, so I need to get some use out of that. Um, mascara, I use the Man Miss Manga on my bottom lashes. And for lashes, I use the Broadway number 76 lashes because my beauty supply store, I guess, is trying to discontinue these. So we, we know that these are $199, if you can see that, $199. And they are 
buy one get one free so uh, essentially a dollar a piece at my beauty supply store so haven't had that much experience with these lashes but this is my second pair from the bunch that i bought and i am going to pick up some more today before they're gone because she basically said the sale is going to be until the inventory is gone so yeah let me know what y'all think which i wear this out the house or not i don't know i think i am but i'm sure i'm going to get some looks but doesn't really matter so yeah that's all i have and um I used a little bit of this on my lids just to take away some of the shine. And this is the lightest color and golden almond finish. Um, my brows were kind of complicated, so I won't even get into all of those products. But yeah, that's about it. So let me know what you think, and I'll catch you girlies in the next video. Bye.